So the last type of flashcard is a multi-line flashcard with numbers in a specific order. So let's say I want to test things in a specific order, like the order of operations, PEMDAS. What I can do is I can make this multi-line flashcard with the three greater than signs, one, two, three. And then I'm going to, because I want it in a list, I'm going to type one and then period. And now I'm going to get it in a specific order. So P, let's E, M, D, A, S. And I'll go ahead and fill in that is parentheses, this is exponents, this is multiplication, this is division, this is addition, and that is subtraction. So now if I were to test this, because that's in a specific order, if I go ahead and test those, uh, I need to get to that one. You can see over here, that one is also in a list. And then here we go. What does pendulum stand for? So it's going to drip by drip, give me one at a time. So I try and remember what one is. Okay, P for parentheses. Next one, what was the next letter? E. Okay, E stand for exponent. Okay, so it's going to drip by drip in a list order, do them one at a time, whereas the bullet points gives them all to you at once. So if you want them specifically one at a time, you want to go ahead and do a multi-line flashcard with numbers where you go ahead and you type those three greater than signs and then type one. So it can be handy if you want to test something in a specific list, if you need to know it in that order. That is the last type of flashcard. Those are the five we use in REM notes. Now it's your turn to go practice them and go use them. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Peace.